Coil aquatic, we reefing. Reefing. in my crib, I got fresh, I got salt water. Salt water. on the rocks, I got all colors. All colors. I made an orange way out of all rubbers. All rubbers. Protein skim will make all bubbles. Okay. Got fish for sale, I'm finna place the order. If it's rare enough, I'll cross the border. Cross. Perimeter checks, it's levels to this. Levels. Macro lens, levels. you see in the pattern. Snail shells, museum of the Vatican. I'm coaching this game, Gary Patterson. Going to Discord, verified, I let you in. I like my lives like ESPN. Just lost some Burnett's, it called STNs. Part of the game when you destined to win. You see me on live, I got questions. Check in. Yeah.
Do the sound bite on that one, gold. <laughs> uh, let's see, Jill. Let me know if you can hear me, dog. You say they're playing hatred, bro? Why wow, they must be dying or Trying to get some of this staghorn off of this um loaded your plant.
Where this stuff did. I was out, man. But it's that horn thick. See you getting down with the scaping. Yeah, man. And it's popping up in a minute. Yeah, I really just came on here, bro, so I could, you know, get this live of this and then I'm gonna make a video of it. So no, y'all got somewhere else to be. That's cool, man. I'm gonna still make a video of it. The stream life is yeah it's a lot of people streaming bro that's really why i go late at night now because you know i let everybody get out the way then i slide in you know so it's all good if y'all want to go show support to somebody else right now because i'm just trying to get this stag horn off of this off of some of these leaves and then i still i already released one of those one of the fish it's outside, so I'll probably just showcase him tomorrow since it's already getting dark. And the other two, man, I can finally got me a couple of uh, Kenya cichlids, man. So they had some. They look, they look pretty good. They was, you know, pretty healthy. So I went on ahead and snagged them boys up. So y'all already know how long I've been waiting on that. Pretty exciting. Getting the fish you've been wanting to get for a while, you know. Went ahead and took about a quarter of the water out too. So I'm gonna go ahead and refill that mug back up with some with some uh fresh water. So I'm pretty sure the plants are like gonna like that. And it's that horn thick. So yeah, man, it, it seemed like all of, I ain't gonna say all, but I went to another fish store today, man. They had some most sick fish and they didn't even have like a clean up crew. What's up on the panel? These both? Yeah, 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 this is just two different views. Same thing. What it look like? It look crazy or something? Two different cameras here, one on iPhone and one on Android. You, you tell me which one is which. <laughs>
thing. I'm gonna throw some of this outside too. Some of this elodium. Let that mud grow out there. I'm gonna have to try to build me a lid or something, man, so the birds won't eat my fish up this year. Look how thick that stuff is. Really, I don't even want to bother trying to get the rest of that one off though. Out here as soon as I get in here. Oh, you like that one, huh, Adam? Yeah, I'm gonna have to find some type of net, fam. Cause uh, I refuse to let them eat eat my fish this year, though. Gonna be doing some uh, duck hunting, bird hunting around this mud. Uh... Had to cut a little piece of driftwood off. The mud was sticking out of the tank. Hey, Jim, you said this plant was done. You didn't have no look with it. Did you have to get some CO2 or or you wasn't able to, you wasn't ever able to keep it alive? So, yeah, bro, I went and picked up some, uh, I got some Amazon sword. And then this, uh, this purple plant. Well, you know the name. Let me get the tag. Yeah, bro, you see, I put some, uh, I put some pokos up here, man. That mud been growing. 
Then it's that ribbon plant I had in the soil. That mud had started dying, so I ended up clipping it. So hopefully it grows some roots from here, continue going. And then, see the pythons, that mud growing new shoots. That's new, but then that's new. It, was, it started with just those two right there. So that mud's growing, bro. That's where I had to cut that driftwood at right there. And uh, uh, her algae been growing on this thing, bro. But yeah, they got Amazon for back there. You know, some of that, um, that her algae out of there. But yeah, this all that, that, that stag horn, man. There's a lot of that shit. That mother thick, too. Oh, it's the same thing. I'm trying to make it feel <laughs> They, they think they slick, man. Brother, you always getting old. Oh, hold on, hold on now. Hold on now. I got some, uh, some Java friends on this drip. See them all right I had to turn the drip a little around. I don't think it was getting enough light. At first, it was facing towards the bottom, so. I even got me some Got me some plant. Got some plant food. That's the food she said they was already feeding them, so drop some of, drop some of that off for now. I used it before. The algae has been trying to take the whole get it, bro. That that algae crazy. Straight over. Drop some more water in there.
Go. Now. Go. Are you sure I know? Oh look, I got another tag. I found it. Hey Jeff, it's a um a teledera, teledera. Ah, you're right. It is a Renique. Renique, boy, you might know a little song, Jeff. You might know a little song. We find out. You have a little song. You better stop now. Put that lid on them. Now this time, last time I did this, man, right after I did the, the water change, came back the next morning from a stream, golden one, the killy had jumped out. So, now, down to three. But I, I like the print though, man. They look cool. Yeah. Thank you. 
look a little beat up. So, you know, hopefully be able to salvage some and the mother's grow. I might have to give me a little CO2, little CO2 kid or something. Yeah, that's what I'm All this stuff that had the stag horn on it, man. Which y'all think I should just just let that mug go? Uh, let that mug go. Yeah, that's with the stag horn on it, man. Y'all think I should just let it go? Jeff, we're gonna see, man. We're gonna see how, how to stay home and treat. Now that I done, I done took out a little bit of water, added some fresh water in, and then now I, I went and got some uh, aquarium plant food. Some stuff I had at first that they was already feeding the plants. Still got to release these other two here. So I got a lot of the, I got a lot of the stag horn, dog. Look like it's a lot of mum or uh, black beard algae on a driftwood. But I'm, I'm gonna let it roll, man. Hey, y'all think if I put some shrimp in here that they'll get eight by these fish or what, dude? Y'all let me know. Or do I need something separate to put the shrimp in? Yeah, man, as soon as I'm gonna put this stuff up, man, I got, got a nice little chat to chat with y'all, man. Talk about some, we got something to talk about. Give me one moment, man. I'm gonna put everything, set everything back right.
Hey man, on that on that Amazon sword, it came like in a you know how it be bundled up. Y'all think I should take it like from out of the bundle and plant an individual, or am I right to leave it bundled up for a little while?
Let me wash my hands, man. We'll be right over.
right, all right, all right. Car is, yeah. But yeah, man, it's, it's been one, uh, one insightful day, man. Hey, what's happening, Aquarium Talk TV? Appreciate you for coming through, man. Once again, everybody, appreciate y'all for coming through. Go to the top. We got Animal, Jeff, uh, Fathom, Shady Grady. Got Plushy came through. J Rock, Craig. What's up? But yeah, man, I went to the fish store today. Uh, I, hey, what's up, I'm George? I'm back. So uh yeah man, I went to the fish store today and uh shit, I was disappointed man. Like the first the first one I went to it was it wasn't even like no pet co pet smart nothing like that. And uh it was more sick fish. What's how I'm fathom? Yeah, it was more sick fish, man, and I'm like, dang, is it, it what, what's going on with the, with the fish world, bro? So that, that's really going to lead me to order offline, man, because I couldn't find any good cleanup crews or, you know, fish that I wanted from the fish store, from that fish store I went to. And I was really hoping, you know, they had nice a nice selection to choose from, in which they did, but it was just not for sale. Kind of how we, what we were speaking on yesterday. Well, this place actually had not for sale road on the tanks, and it had copper red on there too. So I guess they was treating it with copper. And but yeah, man, uh, I didn't end up getting anything from there either. So I just walked in, viewed it, then I walked out. So then uh, I went down the street. I seen another Petco. Went in there. I've been in there before, so I went in there and uh, same thing, man. They had some <laughs> some more sick fish. And some was good, some wasn't. You know, they had some some plants, so I went on ahead and got me some plants. And I seen the Kenya cichlids. They was in good shape, but I still got them in quarantine right now. So uh, yeah, bro. I don't really know what's going on with, with the. He say failed my license test three times today, car guy. Craig, come on over the car, man. Let me sh let me show you, dog. Give you some pointers, man. But, nah, uh, 165 bucks later to fail. Ooh, yeah, that ain't cool, doc. That's not cool. But yeah, man, I'm. He say, and you're going to get next day delivery. Okay. So, yeah, that's what I'm going to do tomorrow, man. I'm going to go ahead and order me some, and you know, hopefully it should be here by Tuesday. And that, that's just the route I'm going to go, you know. So I'm still going to do some more tours around Dallas at the fish stores, but I'm really not liking what I'm seeing right now, man. That's I know how the community rolls, so I don't want to 
go into these fish stores and show y'all some bull and then y'all be like, man, what's going on in Dallas, Texas? <laughs> so they, I refuse to cut that camera on and they, and they make me look bad, G. You must be blind, your pro soul. <laughs> Yo, what's going on, Craig? You you fell in the, the, the driving test three times, man. You know how many fish you could have bought for with a, with that 165 bucks, man. <laughs> but yeah, though, that, that's the route I'm gonna have to go, animal. Cause uh, I really don't get it, though. Um, you know, the lady told me she she had just kind of started, and the person that was supposed to train her haven't been training them so that goes back to what we were saying they they not getting properly trained to even they not even getting properly trained enough to sell you fish they can't give you any information and luckily these fish uh it's not just there well oh yeah i imagine dog they say i'm all about supporting local but some of these local stores let that get to their head and don't hold themselves to a higher standard. Yeah, that, and, and like I say, they not training they people, man. Like, how are you not properly training your employees so they know what these fish, um, what the fish are that they're selling, they, they know what disease they have. Like, they, they can't really get, they can't really give me no information. They say prices is the only reason a lot of us are buying off Amazon, eBay, and other online sellers. I buy local, but if they charge a lot and the quality is so bad, why charge the premium? Exactly. Like I'm not, I'm not really tripping on paying a premium price, but the fish at least being premium water quality. Like I know everything is not going to be pristine, but you shouldn't have fish with cloudy eyes and whole systems with ick and you know at a, at a big box store that's that's not a good look man like i and, and it leads me to believe why you don't have that much inventory on fish because they're getting sick and dying so i have to wait till next week to come in for your new shipment and then you, you're gonna put your new shipment in that same water so why why even spend my money man why so they charge a premium for premium product but they're not holding up their end they're just getting greedy they're just greedy and cutting corn. man exactly bro that's why the, the plants was all in a uh overstock tank you know fish sick like bro i'm definitely gonna find me a good online store i'm sticking to them man so it's a tough economy but where value with quality meats is where the most people shop exactly like you said it's not about the money it's not that people don't have money to go in the box stores it's that when they go in the box stores they, they don't want to spend their money with them because of the quality the quality is not right that's just what i'm saying bro say my local fish store just advertised 236 is for 236 is for 55 dollars each Okay, okay. Well, and that's the thing. I seen some good prices on some tanks. They had a 40 breeder for $60 at, uh, at Petco. Say it's facts. So they, ha they have good prices, but it's the quality. Like me, I'm, really, I'm, I'm a quality over quantity type person. Like I'd rather have a quality. If, if, it me if it means me getting less of it, then that's just what I'll do. But I definitely don't want to get um, a whole bunch of sick fish for a cheap price. <laughs> I'd rather not do that. Yeah, I'd rather not do that at all. You say, uh, I think I'm about to get rid of the big fish in my 180 and start over with smaller fish. Man, to me, you can get a lot more in there. Like the 180s, you know, all those big tanks, they cool, and I'm I'm definitely going to give me some. But I'm not, it's not guaranteed I'm going to put big fish in those tanks. I'm, I'm not going to say I'm going to do that. Because uh, 
you could put a lot more fish in there. He said, I love my 180. I know something like the Bicer or something like that'll go in a large tank like that because, of course, they're going to get big. He said, uh, bro, this one store had $14 card Cardinals uh, Tetris because they're on premium than Neon Tetris. But down the road is a place that has pre-quarantine, good-looking Cardinal, Cardinal Tetris for $3. Yeah, that's crazy, G. And then that, that's another thing. The, the fish store I went in uh, earlier, the prices was high as giraffe. You know what I'm saying? So if I live there, car, I'll share my fish. <laughs> For sure, appreciate it, bro. <laughs> so I think it would be more. Right. Yeah, you know, versus seeing five big fishes swimming. Say if you seeing you 14, you know, to 25 little fishes. That's it's a way better look to me but um yeah bro the prices are super high like for the the frags of coil and the fish everything was really like overpriced but once again if it's quality i wouldn't even mind paying 40 40 bucks on a fish but then if i see that the tank is Almost every fish in the tank is sick, then I'm not finna pay that 40 bucks, bro. You can scratch that. So it, it's definitely not a money thing, man. It's a, are you gonna jeopardize my whole system when I put your fish in my tank type? So I'm a flood that bit. <laughs> nah, for sure, bro. And I think I've been, been getting my practice up because that's what Jeff was saying. Shit, he he flood his tanks like he he stock them up pretty nice, and he don't have any problems, as far as I know of. You know, we see he have nice, good quality fish himself. They're breeding, they look happy. So I'm definitely man gonna. That's why I put as many fish as I did in this tank. Like you know, at first it was a little active, and then I got those eight of uh, the six more X-ray tetras. It liven the tank up a little more, so I don't feel that it's, it's overcrowded, you know. Um, I definitely want to see how these plants gonna how it's gonna go with these plants, man. You know if I'm gonna get this CO2, but <laughs> that's what Jeff said. He on, that's the only luck he had with this type of plant. Over here, Nikki. So yeah, I'm definitely uh. I'm definitely gonna look forward, bro, to ordering online now. I'm definitely looking forward to that. Yeah, it definitely look more active, bro. So, see, I see, um, so now that I changed this water, bro, and put this this fertilizer in there, liquid fert. I think it's a liquid fert. Aquarium plant food provides micro, macro, and micronutrients required by freshwater plants. So it looks like it has uh, calcium, magnesium, sulfur, boron, iron, zinc. So it has a, some, some nice uh, elements. So I guess that it's gonna replenish those plants back with the, with the nutrients. So I was wondering though, since I uh, got the staghorn, did I have too much nutrients in there though? So, that ain't for sure, man. But I definitely did that water change. Check this out. So I'll be laughing at my seal and either, man. I mess around and got black seal instead of the clear. And I didn't use any masking tape. Had resealed this tank. So yeah, I'm saying my lines a little squiggly, but hey, it's holding that water though. But I know next time to add me some um 
ammo man he said you far you two away from 200 what he said i'm texting my grandma <laughs> My man, Father, man. He said, he takes his grandma. Yeah, tell grandma to subscribe to your boy, man. Take out for some ice cream. So, y'all go run up, run up through subs for your boy. Need two more for that two hundred, man. I appreciate y'all. Y'all been holding it down. I know a lot of people been on streams and stuff lately, but y'all still been making y'all way in here, and I appreciate that, bro. No, y'all part of the car club you now. But yeah, bro, that, that's what I done took, though, man, from these past two days trying to go in the big box store. My boy Animal say he had 151, man. Y'all ain't sub to Animal. Y'all go sub up to him, too. Show him some support, man. I know that's what we about in here. We show support to each other. We gonna make sure we we all uplifted. Yeah, we gonna we gonna make sure we all winning. It ain't just gonna be one. It ain't just gonna be one person winning. We all winning. They say got you the two hundred, brother. Let's go. Let's see. Let's see, man. Let me go check. Shout out to all the people over there on Rumble and uh, Twitch. We also streaming on there too right now. I know we don't ever see they chat. Got so many damn tabs open. Let's go. We at that 200. Yeah. Say, man. We popping bottles tonight. We at 200. Put them bottles in the chat, man. Y'all pop a bottle with your boy. We just hit that 200, man. Yeah. It feel it feel great when you when you really, you know, accomplishing whatever you want to accomplish, bro. We been making it happen. Staying dedicated, motivated, all of that. Then I got a new achievement, 75,000 views. So pe people really been, you know, tuning in to us, man. Everybody that didn't share the video, you didn't, you didn't shout me out. You know, it, that's what this from. We, I didn't just do it, we did it, you feel me? I appreciate y'all. We gonna study go up. Shit, as long as I got breath, we gonna study keep going up, bro. What's up? We didn't we didn't gain 68 subscribers in the last 28 days. We got we got our foot on their neck, man. Like <laughs> the pressure is applied. Like this is great, man. This is great. For real. He said, appreciate it, bro. Nah, man, appreciate you, man, for real. But yeah, though, so I got to say, man, we're going to stay elevating, though, and we're going to keep going up. Shit, we're going to find us a good um, store to order from online, and we're going to see how that roll, man. See how that go for us, man, you know. Hopefully that be a, a better experience than the stores I've been going in lately. 
He said I had like 400 in November and hit 1K on New Year's. It happens quick, bro. You got to keep it. Man, that, that's what's up, Fathom. That's a good look right there. Uh, he said somebody got one of the four. <laughs> it was me. <laughs> I ordered the animal. I ordered one of them. Just joking with you, bro. He was looking at them, uh, them yellow banded accords last night. I think it was like three left, y'all. I told him I was finna order them, but I didn't do it though. So <laughs> it wasn't me, Adam. <laughs> but yeah, bro, we, I'm, I'm gonna keep it up, man, because we we mashing right now. We building something like this is for me. It's something. It, it may be only 200 subs, but it's something though, bro. Like six months ago, I, I was only at not even six months ago. Two months ago, I think I was like at 50 some subs, 60 some subs. So, just been, just been doing uh, what we came here to do. And I appreciate y'all, bro. Can't say it enough. But yeah, definitely, man. Uh, like I say, I don't know what y'all local stores look like, but. Sh Y'all get a chance, man. Go, go show your boy. Let me know I'm not tripping that, that Dallas not the only one slacking. <laughs> right now, I'm I'm embarrassed to do uh, the little fish pop-ups. Like, I was really excited to do it. You know, I was like, yeah, I'm going to start, you know, touring the fish stores for y'all. Man, I wonder do I need to start calling the head or something. Hey, uh, he say, don't don't thank me, thank my grand. Hey, shout out, grandma. You feel me? We going to the top, G Ma. We going to the top. I have to sit up, send a uh, edible arrangement or something. Yeah, most definitely, bro. I just wanted to come out here and kick it with y'all one time. Let y'all know what was going on. I said I was going to hit up another fish, though. I did. And before I even cut the camera on, I went through and made sure this time. And lo and behold, they had some sick fish. They had the saltwater fish was sick. And you could tell the freshwater fish was getting sick. So I ain't even getting none from them, man. I'm hoping my grandma rocks out the low. Man, definitely rock out the low codes, man. Fella put it, Spotify, Apple Music. Y'all go put on that low codes, man. Yeah, grandma dudes did the big one, you feel me? She got your boy to 200. Yeah, but uh, low, low codes, man, that's the music page, man. Y'all go check me out. Been getting some support over there as well. So you know when you when you got a lot of things going, that's what lead not leads me to believe from experience, bro. You need a team. Like you can't do everything yourself. So you know, get y'all a machine together, bro. One person the arms, one person the legs. You know, you need a, a whole machine together to really put together a put together a, um, a proper plan, man. So that, that's what I'm, I'm really working on, putting together a team, cause you can't do everything, bro. If you making a video, you trying to edit the video, you doing the production for the video, you doing the music for the video, you doing everything. You, you gotta have your team together and light, lighten your load. And you know, everybody come in and, and make this thing happen. And that's really, you know, what I'm on now. So any of y'all need some help with something? I ain't, I'm looking to network. I'm looking to build. So, you know, if you're really trying to build something with a structure, we build a, a great a foundation, then I let me, man. Sure. Hit me up on Instagram. Shoot me a comment or something. I, I get in contact with you. Contact me on Discord. If you, you serious about building a foundation, then let's do it. Like we can come together and build something. That's where I'm at with this. 
He said, your outro music go hard, dude. Have you thought about uploading it to the channel? Nah, I really haven't, bro. I haven't even thought about uploading it to the channel. Because to be honest, y'all only really hearing, what, the 30 seconds of it? It's a whole nother front end. Like, I wrapped a whole nother four, four to six bars before the part that y'all hearing. So you ain't even heard the full, the full version of it. So <laughs> See, that's what's dope too. I only dropped 30 seconds. He said, I went looking for the whole, ver okay. Good look then. I'm gonna drop the whole version on, on the, um, the music page. And I think that's what this all about, integrating it to make everything flow together, you know, where I'm not leaving one thing behind. So I'm trying to focus on this, but then I'm leaving this behind. I can't do that. I got to have everything flowing in motion at the same time. So that's why I say you got to have a team. If I'm posting here, you got to have somebody else posting somewhere else, like making everything flow. So we definitely finna build a, a major network. It ain't necessarily gotta just be all about fish. It, whatever you, you feel like you wanna build on, you need some help, I let me drop it on here too, whoa. Nah, for sure, I will, I will. He say, we in a Baisha song, come here. <laughs> nah, that'll be dope too. Like, Buddy had a song about the plants, man. He started dropping tracks about the fish. It's going to be on a whole nother level. <laughs> Get together with uh, Steph and Pete, drop another guppy mosh pit. <laughs> yeah. You scared of a little bit of algae? <laughs> but nah, we definitely going to do that, man. But look, man, no, no fish, no fish be happy though. That's really what I be looking for. I do a lot of tank watching, you know, making sure all the fish good. But yeah, man, I'm finna, I'm finna really go on and grab me something to eat real quick, man. And shit, it's still early. It's only nine. I probably hop back on, man. Let it breathe uh, real quick. I appreciate y'all for rolling through, you know, for the time y'all did, man. Y'all be great, be you. Stay positive, man. Car out. Cool, look, part of you reefing. Fish in my crib, I got fresh, I got salt water. Salt on the rocks, I got all colors. All colors. I made a horse way out of all rubbers. All rubbers. Protein skim will make all bubbles. Huh? Got fish for sale, I'm finna place the order. If it's rare enough, I'll cross the border. Oh. Perimeter checks, it's levels to this. Macro lens, you see in the pattern. Snail shells, Museum of the Vatican. I'm coaching this game, Gary Patterson. Join the Discord, verified, I let you in. I like my lives like ESPN. Just lost some Burnett, it called STN. It's part of the game when you destined to win. You see me online, I got questions. Check in.